Okay. I know this is a long shot, but... And this is probably not going to happen. But I'm asking fans if they could please stop with the spoilers and other um, people, you know... I mean, I, I know enough about this movie already, okay? I just want to enjoy it ha the way it was supposed to be, jo you know? I don't want to be in a movie theater saying, oh, this scene's coming up, oh, that scene's coming up, oh, this is going to happen, that's going to, you know? I want to be surprised, okay? I want to be surprised, and I just want to enjoy the movie and let it unfold for what it is. You know, and then after it's over, I'll judge it on my own merits and, you know, whether it's good, bad, you know, hopefully it's good. But we really don't know if we're going to make the, the November release date. Um, but I hope we do. But I really want to be surprised. I want to, you know, I know so much about this movie already, it's unbelievable you know and i know especially when we get closer there's going to be more spoilers like major spoilers than there already is i mean we pretty much know half the movie already we know it's a spangler family we know there's new equipment um we know the ghost that was in the trap was a terror dog or a sentinel terror dog um the pk e meter uh, is some type of zapper, they up, they fixed the PKE meter, and it's now been upgraded to some type of zapper, or taser, or whatever, um, the original cast is back, we know we're gonna see the original guys, the remaining guys, in the jumpsuits, for one last battle, we know Gozer's back, obviously, um, we know Evo Shandor is the main villain. I mean, let's just enjoy it for what it is, okay? And, you know, I don't want to be in the movie theater, oh yeah, this scene's coming up, that scene's coming up. You know, I just want to be like, oh wow. But we live in an age where, you know, there's no privacy and social media and... You know, all the information that's out there is just insane. But, um, yeah, so, you know, like, for example, I'm not really a Star Wars fan. And, I mean, I like the movie and everything, and I, I, I watch it when it's on or whatever. But when Star Wars The Force Awakens came out, uh, a, day or, a day before it came out, some fan leaked a scene where uh, Han Solo gets killed by his son. He sees a lightsaber stabbing him, going right through him. At first I thought it was fake, but then I realized that, no, it's real. And, ooh, did that guy get bashed online. Fans were so pissed off at him, uh, spoiling that. And so, you know... Anyway, I'm at work, and these um, nerds dressed up as Jedis walk in, and one of them were, 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 was kind of rude, and I, all I asked was, hey, you know, you going to see Star Wars, and he looks at me, and he goes, no, I'm here to see the Smurfs. And I was thinking about, hey, by the way, Han Solo gets killed in there, and but, you know, I didn't want them to, like, you know, find out, you know, my work schedule and come and do something, so I was like, oh, I'll just keep it to myself, but, you know, it's like, that's what's gonna happen, okay, it's really, spoilers are inevitable, so, it's gonna happen whether you like it or not, best thing to do is don't use Facebook or social media or the internet for the upcoming days, because some, some fan out there is gonna, oh, hey, look at this, you know, to spoil the ending or stuff like that. I mean, we already know the equipment. We already know the storyline. We already know the characters and all this other stuff. So let's just save the rest for the theater. Be surprised and just enjoy it. What You know, enjoy the movie the way it's supposed to be enjoyed.
the way it's supposed to be. You know, just let it unfold the way the, the director intended it to be. So, anyway, that's all I got. Um, hope you guys are doing well. Smash that like button. Hit the subscribe if you already have an N.O. See you next time.